In the last episode of Epic Battle Fantasy, I opened a door to an icy cave. In today's episode, I explore the cave as it gets icier by the room. I'm Renegade X, and this is my show. <laughs> Hello random people from across the internet, I'm Renegade X, and welcome to the show sponsored by Fatigue. Because I have, I have just been absolutely whipped these past two weeks, it's just not even funny. New job, it's, it's a pain. Just like, people, you know, I've been talking to my friends, some of them are like, how do you manage to keep a job and a YouTube channel? I don't, I clearly don't. Why well, I haven't uploaded in the past two weeks. I just... Yeah, I'm just... Whew. Anyways. Enough about my life. How's your day, Ben? Fascinating. Not so fascinating as that thing. Ow. Stop it. Okay. Uh, you weak to fire? You are now. As opposed to previously. Wait a minute, what about you? Are you weak to fire? Yeah, you don't resist it, so. Ah, just worm after worm after worm. I'm pretty sure there's a, it's like a bad orchard. Wait, if they're weak to lightning, then why don't I just shockify them? There we are. And temper tantrum. And then electrify. Oh, I miss this music and this game. Oh dear. I'm not gonna have fun with this lady, am I? Hmm. Weak to poison. Weak to poison. Let's just shockify everybody. Oh dear. Hmm. I think. No, I don't. Dang it. Well, looks like I'm just gonna have to defend this turn. Grr, stop it! Hey, what'd you do that for? Don't... Oh, please don't. Oh, thank goodness. Okay. We'll have to siphon it. First, I want to see if Matt can maybe... Unleash the fury. Well, that went well. Oh, ice crystal bear. First, I'll hit you all with fire. Then I'll have no like scan y'all. My guess is that's an ice type. Hey, no. Ah, bad. Shame on you. All right, switching out to no legs and no, bad, nine lives, there we go. Perfect. Now, you are in fact weak to fire, but also poison and darkness. How do you feel about lightning? Nobody really cares, so. Let's do that. Ah, not. Let's not do that. Ah! Or that. Should have gotten around here when I had the chance. Do I have. Ah, oh, dang it. Oh well. Guess you won't be getting XP from this one. That's a pity. I wonder. Oh, yeah. 
Oh, it's a Growler Bear. Is that... Hmm, I feel like that's a pun. Come on, come on, come on. Yes! Growler Bear, your name shall be... Growly. No, wait, that's Growly. Growly. There we are. Ow! Ow, double ow. Darn it, now Lance won't be getting XP from this either. I <sighs> better switch him out to uh, Anna. Hang on, I should get more coffee. Uh, let's see. Blah, blah, blah. Blah, blah, blah! Neat. Now, hmm. Let's do vines, see what that does. No! Come on! Dang it, why is Matt the only one who can take a hit now? Uh, let's use Sushi Cat. There. Now with no legs, back up to full health. Dang it. No, don't. No! All right, looks like I'm doing this the hard way by myself. Chill. Ice and water damage. Effect removed by fire damage. Well, hold on now. Why don't I go ahead and slice you up and close that out that I accidentally clicked up? No, don't. No! Okay. All right. So, Matt is the only one getting XP from this. Good to know. All right. May as well unleash the legend. Oh gosh. And one last fire spike. Well, somebody leveled up and that's good. All right, and I've got other things. So that that is good as well. All right. Now let's see if I can figure out a way to get up into there. I don't think there is a way. I think I gotta like come down from here. Or come from down here. Mm. Well, that's a pity. Let's fight this thing and maybe give some other people some XP now. Oh, right, now I remember. I was gonna um, solve this puzzle. Let's see. Oh, I get it. Hmm. There we are. Perfect. Ooh, got some coffee from that too. Always important, that coffee. All right. Seems like I should switch to my fire weapons. I'll at least switch out to Lance. And use his fire weapons. And... I really should just switch out fire weapons. I will, I will do that after this. How's that sound? But first... Star Power FTW! Oh no. Maybe I should have focused on one guy. Then we would, wouldn't have five attacks incoming. Yes, that might have been a, a good idea. Wonder how these guys feel about electricity. 
Oh, is that a lightning bug in Lance's gun? I just now realized. Oh, that is not cool. Uh, I mean, yeah, it is, but... Okay. So, question. How do you feel about lightning? Well, you don't resist, so... Screw it! Hyper beams for everybody! And now we use sushi cats. Because I want to heal Matt up. Dang it! I didn't heal up Matt. Y'all are defending, which is making me somewhat irritated. Hmm, I wonder. Let's see, they're all wet now, so I'm just thinking maybe I can just electrocutionate them all. Well, most of them all. Yeah, I won't even bother with a temper tantrum this time. Oh, lovely, these guys. Uh, okay, so, since you are weak to lightning, I will now begin shock- the shock- the beatings will continue until morale improves. Well, I know my morale is improving. No! Everybody's getting XP this turn, no matter what you say. Hmm. Okay, first we nine lives. Then we switch out to Natalie. Then we electrocutionate everybody. As for Matt, and eh, we'll just shock this guy into oblivion. My strategy of focusing on one dude in particular has succeeded. But at what cost? Pretty much no cost, seems. Now let's focus on the blue creep. And one more electrocution shock. As opposed to anaphylactic shock, I suppose. Stop defending! You know, on second thought, keep defending. I don't like your offense. Your offense offends me, good sirs. Or madams, I really can't tell. Do folks even have concept of gender? Yeah, that's the real mystery we're all wondering here. Um, let's see here. Legend is power... Let's do this one. And... Hmm. 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 Well... No Legs does have holy attacks, which you can probably use to great effect. Wait, if they're weak to holy, I wonder... I think I have a way to heal up Natalie. Just real quick. Oh yeah, I keep forgetting how powerful that skill is. Well, he's surrendering, so I'm gonna focus on the other guy. Well, I was gonna let you live, but apparently no likes has decided you must die. Sorry, but the cat has chosen death for you, specifically. Hmm, I wonder. No, I'd have to come from the bottom, wouldn't I? Anyways, saving time. Let's see what's this direction. This architecture is amazing and so well preserved. These temples must have been very impressive back in their day. They're impressive now, so. All the aliens could have built this. I'm calling it now. Thousands of years ago. The people who lived here must have been influenced by extraterrestrial forces. That's possible, but not likely. 
an organized civilization with many slaves could easily have constructed something like this. Perhaps they built these to honor their glorious leader. Which could have been a man much like me. Maybe some travelers were cold and just wanted to build a house? Nya nya. You also don't buy any of those explanations, no legs? They're not too bright, are they? Eh, what makes you an expert in ancient history? How can you say for sure it wasn't aliens or communists? Well, for one thing, Lance is a fascist, so communism wasn't really brought into the subject until you brought it up. What are you trying to hide, Anna? Second, she's the mage. I think she knows what she's talking about. Mages are typically smart people. I'll have you know I was a straight A student at university. <laughs> just not any particular university, just university. And history was one of my favorite subjects. I learned all about the Forgotten Kingdom of Cats, the history of the major provinces, theories of dart and lock magics, and about many popular myths and legends. You can learn a lot from reading, you know. If you're so smart, how did you end up on a dangerous scouting mission then? And not in some comfortable academic role. Well, uh, I don't want to talk about it. I left you after an embarrassing incident. Oh, lovely. We've gone from cutscene to absolute... Uh, hmm. How can I get that treasure? Well, I got that treasure, so that's important. Hmm, wait. Hmm. I wonder. Just trying to think here. Give me a minute. Get off my back, man! I wonder if you know. I shouldn't be telling you this. It's kind of a secret, but... Spill the beans already! Don't hide anything from us! Well, there's items and quests you can only get around the time of certain holidays. Oh, really? What holidays are those? Er, uh, Valentine's Day, uh, Easter, and um, Halloween and Christmas. I think there may be a fifth one. But um bum Ha! I don't celebrate on any of those, so that's no good. That's not my problem. <laughs> she is correct. That is not her problem. So, let's see. I'm trying to figure out how do I get... Ooh, I wonder. Uh, let's see. No. But then maybe yes. But what about... Hmm. Is this one of those puzzles I'm going to have to come back to later? Uh, I really hope not. Hmm. No, 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 no. Maybe? I think I'm onto something. Aha! There we are. Excellent! Now I got the Wrecking Rod. Like a wrecking ball on a stick, which also explodes. Alright, so there's that. Um... Hmm. Oh, I also got these rune things, so that's good. Let's see. Right, right. Hmm. Counter note. I may have to come back to this later. Eh, well. So what if I do? How do I get up to there? Well, I guess that's more exploring for me to do. Hmm. I really want to figure out what sort of god these ancient people worshipped, and what happened to their civilization. We're finding all these ruins that historians have never seen before, and they're raising so many exciting questions. Maybe they were just doped up narcissists and they made sculptures of themselves with exaggerated foreheads and a third eye. These stone faces, they look kind of like space aliens, don't they? Maybe these people worshipped aliens and then they were all abducted by UFOs! And then the aliens modified all the history books, and that's why no one knows about them! I don't know why I'm briefly turning into an Irish Mickey Mouse! Ha ha! Clearly this was a totally Italian surveillance state. The giant eye of Big Brother watched over the civilizations and make sure they were just... Bleh. Let me try that sentence again, this time with clarity. 
The giant eye, big brother, watched over the citizens to make sure they were not guilty of wrong thing. Do as the eye says, or it's rats to the face. Meow, meow. Not a threat to someone who eats rats. No, I don't think they were earless catmen, no legs. Come on, guys, I'm trying to think seriously here. Oh, yeah, we didn't hear the rest of your story from earlier, Nat. So, what was the reason you ended, you left university and ended up out here with those peasants? I'd rather forget about it. I'm not a peasant. You are now, peasant. Wasn't anything exciting. I got caught writing smutty fan fiction involving a member of staff. A lecturer of mine, actually. <laughs> are you serious? That's the reason. Yeah, it was a bit silly. Couldn't face my class or the main involved after that. I can't breathe. That's too stupid to be true. I'm going to die from laughter. Hmm, I wonder what sort of man Natalie is interested in. Maybe I should be taking notes here. I think she's interested in the type that doesn't kidnap her. Just a thought. Maybe someday I'll get over the shame and go finish the course. But overall, I'm enjoying my time off, and I think I'm learning more out here anyway. You can laugh if you want. I don't even care. Yeah! <laughs> and obviously, I've learned my lesson, so now I have my fan fiction where no one will ever find it. Did she just give me a funny look just now? I think she found your fanfiction, Nat. Or Matt. Ah! Uh. Wrong button, I think. Okay. Uh. You're weak to explosions and darkness. You're weak to darkness and explosions. Okay. Well, I would explode, y'all, but I haven't got the time. What's low gravity? Everyone gets lighter between turns. All right. How do y'all feel about lightning, you... Oh, boy. Hmm. I think I'm gonna wait. I can maybe still use Matt to take out these giant robots. Mm. Okay. Let's go for darkness. The best element. No, don't you dare. Who built these robots, and why are they attacking us? Whoa. Okay, that's interesting. I'm bringing in Lance now, just because he's the one with bomb skills. Okay. Um, blah, blah, blah. Moab. Always open with your most powerful attack, kiddos. That's how you get them. All right, go no legs. No, no legs. All right, we're gonna have to revive him. Why is this area low gravity? That is a very interesting choice. All right. Sushi Cat time! Activates! Your evade is down. How are you miss. How are you dodging all these attacks? Wait, what does light do? Wind damage is taken by. is increased, but earth damage is reduced. Okay. Makes sense, I guess. Now Lance can heal. It's nice that I have like two or three healers. Not entirely sure I fully count no legs as a healer. Just because such a mighty beast is afraid of us. This somehow makes me feel even more powerful than killing it. I'm not entirely sure it's a it counts as a beast. Probably more of a construct. But I am amused that robots feel fear in this world. Okay, all you guys. This time I can just burn it at y'all. What else are you weak to? Ooh, lightning. Perfect. Hey! How high level are you guys, anyways? I'm starting to think I might be a tad under level for this. Two 
just a tad. Level 31, everyone else is level 28. Okay, yeah, that would explain it. I got some grinding to do. Um, let's go for this. And let's use nine lives, because I don't feel like dying today. Always been a fan of continuing to live. I mean, if they're higher level, that would explain why they are, uh, what's the word? Why they're constantly evading all my attacks. Hmm. Run out of things to say here. Usually I just comment on the obvious and what's going on here. But I mean, it's obvious these guys feel some sort of fear. I'm just wondering if the robots, do they actually feel fear? Or is it just like some sort of logic self-preservation instinct that's not entirely fear? Eh, I'm sure it's a long story. Uh, let's see. Airstrike. Let's do that one. Oh dear, this is going to be a long fight, isn't it? Well, luckily everyone has auto revive, so that should help. Oh dear. Ow! Not good. All right. Let's sh Why don't we hit people with wind skills? How do you feel about darkness? You complete. You're only weak to. Hmm, interesting. Let's bring in Anna, because I believe she has some decent wind skills. You actually resist wind, though. But, hang on. 50% wind resistance, but they're light, which means something, I'm sure. Oh, I shouldn't have used darkness. Dang it. Whatever. I got, um, let's do fire. Right now for Anna, let's use hurricane and rock them like a hurricane. No! No! Okay, phew. Oh no. No! Okay. Idea here. Gotta revive everybody. So, but first I'll switch out to... I'll need to switch in Natalie. Then I'll need to use... Oh no, Nine Lives is on cooldown. But I do have an espresso. Now let's bring in Lance. I can't bring in Lance just yet. Okay, but I'll tell you what I can do. Oh, you get bonus HP. Neat. Let's see. Let's try shocking everybody with lightning. Okay, so he resists it. That's good to know. Probably could have checked that out earlier, but whatevs. Hmm. He resists lightning, but you don't resist lightning, do you? Hmm. Oh boy. No, no, no! Oh, phew. Ah! Okay, that's it! I don't care what this does to the mage dogs. Alright, let's see the darkest night, and we will show us keep my sight. But those who worship me might be where my power! The god has flight!
That may have been an error. Um, okay. I'm gonna focus my efforts on the mage dogs right now. Some of my magic's been disabled for the time, er, some of my magic's been disabled for the time being. Better play safe till the effect wears off. Ah, oh, dang it! Hope revive wasn't this one of the spells you disabled, because I'm gonna need that. Okay, limit break. All his limit breaks would just heal everybody, though. Revive is... Okay. Let me try something. <clears throat> Wait, no, not you. <clears throat> Strength beyond limit! Absolute oblivion! Dang it! Double dang it! Okay. And now for no legs, um... I'll just use the shadowy strike again. Dang it! Dang it! Why do they know Cure? Oh, goody, she has auto revive. Okay, so I'll switch out no legs to Matt so I can revive him. I better level up from this. Let's do airstrike. Stop it! Grr. Hmm, I wonder. Maybe I can siphon one or both of them. Let's do you. Okay, and now, do we have... Well, there is poison gas, but that wouldn't really... Mm, let's go for plasma field. Ah, dang it. At least Natalie's still alive. Alright, switch to Natalie, speaking of. Revive Lance, and then have Lance use a heal spell. Just to make sure everybody survives this. Oh goody, they're running away. Good little puppy, please run away and don't get involved with us. It doesn't end well for you. Thank goodness they ran away. And thank goodness somebody leveled up. Unfortunately, that is going to have to do it for this episode. If you did enjoy, please be sure to give a like, a comment, a subscribe, and whatever. And in the meantime, you will see me in the next video. Bye bye